Okay, so fun fact. Um, up until this point, I had only really been videotaped in like truck stop parking lots and bathroom stalls. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm super excited. I brought out the old butch shirt. Um, today we are gonna be reacting to my very first YouTube video ever. My channel is officially a year old today. This is the first video I launched on that channel. I just thought it'd be really fun to like go in and just see like how my channel started versus how it is now one year later. Why don't we just get into it? All right, I think it's recording. Yeah, perfect. <clears throat> All right, my first YouTube video. And I picked the perfect time to do it with YouTube's new rules. Anyway. 17 seconds into it. So I don't know if that was supposed to be my straight voice or if my throat was just like exhausted that week or something, cause you know, truck stops. I literally got a haircut and I shaved for this video. Like that was back when I like cared. I'm like, I would dress up in like a theme and everything. And that's like, yeah, now I just like film when I can and I'm just putting on whatever I'm wearing. And it's usually one of those like short sleeved hoodies. Didn't know how to do thumbnails yet. So I would just pick like whatever YouTube randomly screen captured from my video. And then I'm talking about like the new YouTube rules. That was like before we clearly knew what was going on with all the FTC and COPA stuff. And so I started this channel, but I didn't even know how long it was gonna go. I thought like it was gonna get shut down before it even started. Today, I just wanna do this as like a test run, a pilot, whatever. So we're gonna do something super easy and it is the 2018 Dreamtopia Merman Ken, which is something I've wanted ever since I was a little gaby. This is like literally just... Um, and that's still true. I absolutely love the Merman Ken. He's always in the background of all my videos. He's my channel mascot. Like, I absolutely have wanted this since I was like a little kid. Like, um, he... And he, this is the doll that finally made me take the plunge to make this channel. Just everything that I've wanted since I was a kid and it's Playline at Walmart. I think it's less than $8. It's just fantastic. Uh, but why don't we unbox it and get a closer look? back has absolutely no, no nothing. Um, so this is before I th found the 1000 times um, speed up on Premiere Rush. Um, I edit through like iMovie and Premiere like it's a mix of both. iMovie will only let you speed stuff up two times and this was before I knew that I could speed it up even more through a different app. Is the easiest unboxing ever now that they don't have everything pinned in a ton of plastic. So as you can see we got cute little scaled cuff links held in by rubber bands which I'll probably keep on there until they go yellow. And then we got his cute little seashell necklace and his beautiful little star rainbow melt ombre tail thing. And I'm still just as descriptive a year later, um, his beautiful ombre male tell thing, it's a fin, Jeffrey. Like, you knew that. It was my first video, I was super nervous. Um, in fact, if you guys look at my fingers, you'll see like one of them was chewed up and that happens a lot when I'm nervous. I just like eat my fingers off. And then he has that typical Ken face, blonde hair, all that stuff. And he has like, the basic points of articulation at the head, neck, the shoulder, it can go out. And then here at the hips, 
The only thing that would make it a little bit better is some articulation right here so the fin could go up and down without having to bend the kind of rubbery plastic that's down here. But I absolutely love this. Just everything I ever needed. He's fantastic. Super, super queer. Just everything about him screams like inclusivity except for like you know the light skin tone but if this is as popular as I think it is because there's like two left in my whole entire town we might actually see some more mermen ken with like maybe a thicker body type or even a different skin tone which would be fantastic um, even at the beginning of my channel I was calling out for better representation I mean, we finally got like a merman Ken that wasn't part of some weird Toys R Us exclusive or whatever that, um, that blue tailed merman prince thing was. Um, but we finally just got like a Playline merman doll. Um, I don't know, like 20 years after I wanted one. And I think he's fantastic. And I don't know about you guys, but mine sold out everywhere, like in my town. They spit him out in like 2018 and we're at the end of like 2020 almost. And we haven't had like another Merman Ken come out in the Dreamtopia line. And I was really hoping for like, like a deeper skin tone, a more Latino, a more Asian looking guy. Um, even like a broad bodied Ken would be really cool in like a Merman tail and everything. So um, I, I don't know if we're gonna get another Playline one for a minute. And there's that designer one um, that you guys better not up because I want him really bad and, and I swear if any of you voted for that blonde haired blue tailed mermaid that also made it into the finals I will fight you in an Applebee's parking lot and win. <laughs> back to the video Oops. him from the back they do that typical no decoration on this side kind of thing well there's decoration they just didn't paint it Super easy, just so cute. I just, I can't with this one. It's fantastic. And those eyebrows, those are goals right there. I'd love to have some eyebrows like that. And that's still true. If I ever get like any cosmetic surgery of any kind, it's gonna be like eyebrow implants because I love like the natural shape of my eyebrows and everything and I can like enhance them with makeup and everything. But um, I wanna get my eyebrows done. I don't know if that's a thing people do but I'm gonna get it done. <clears throat> okay, ew. Um, I never use a fade transition anymore. I don't know what that was. It's like hard cuts only for me now. Um, yeah. Well guys, that is the 2018 Dreamtopia Ken doll. I, like I said multiple times, I love it. Um, I'm still experimenting with my background and setup and everything, and I'm sure, like, the way I'm filming this, you can hear, like, every lip smack I'm doing, every sound that's in the air, but, you know, I'm starting out, and I'm just, I'm just really excited to get this going. I've been doing it for years, just thinking about it, and I finally took the plunge, so. Anyway, thank you. Okay guys, so that was um, my very first YouTube video ever. It actually has like a decent amount of views for the size of my channel. It's got like over a thousand um, and it's only like four minutes and probably not tagged well, no thumbnail, none of that stuff. I was really excited to get my channel started because I've been on YouTube since like Kelly's video of sh about shoes like was the most viral video on there, you know? So I've talked about having a YouTube channel for over a decade and I finally did it and I'm really happy. And in a year it's grown more than like I thought it was gonna. Like my size is like a small size in comparison to like some other people, but I love that I've gone even this far. So I will link the original video down below if you wanna watch it, um, even though we kind of just went over it in here. That was me at the beginning. Um, thank you guys so much, and I will see you in the next video.